This is default Microsoft Flight Simulator, and as you can see, it is very grey, it is very brown and very washed out. But what if there was a way to enhance your flight sim? Let me show you. Hello there guys and girls and welcome back to Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 where today, as you can hear, I've got a bit of a croaky voice, but anyway, I'm finally here with a video on showing how to enhance the default looks and colouring of Microsoft Flight Simulator. Now by default the game is very washed out and got this almost like brown sort of filter over it, but I've enhanced the game so that you bring out all the pretty colours in the world, all the greens, the blues and the contrast, and just to make it all look really, really, like, realistic, because the game by by itself, just as a base game, looks realistic, like, just by its nature, but it, the colouring is not there, it's just, it's just that simple, the colours are just not there, and especially when flying at night, I want my game to look amazing, so I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Now, it is really easy, but before we get started, the first thing you need to do is make sure you have the NVIDIA uh, control panel open, and that you have experimental features enabled, okay, this will enable your recolouring. Now, the system we use to recolor the sim is called Freestyle. So to activate Freestyle, we need to first start by pressing Alt F3 and clicking on one of the three profiles that are given to you in Styles. Press on the plus menu to add some filters. Now, here you can add a number of filters, but we're going to add brightness and contrast. We're going to add clarity, and then we're going to add color. So what we can do now is simply mess around until we like the sim as like in like the color that we want it. First things I recommend to do is turn the tint and tint intensity to absolute zero as we don't need the tint on the, um, the game itself. We just want to recolor the basic look of it. So I will start by bringing the temperature down a bit. Uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator always looks very warm, so I usually bring the temperature down a little bit. The clarity will basically just make your game like look a lot sharper. There is a sharpening effect in some games, but this uh, is clarity. And to be honest, I think it just looks a bit better. It will also enhance like the visual reflections in the game. It, it just looks so nice. So as you can see here, I'm just messing around with the clarity, darkness, and offset just to make sure, like, or just to see, rather, what I like and what I think looks realistic, uh, depending on the weather and, like, the time of day and where I am. This does take a bit of like, trial and error, it does take a bit of messing around to work out, but once you're happy with how your sim looks, you'll simply be able to press, press on done, and then the game overlay will simply just save, and it will always be there when you activate the game. And guys and girls, it is that easy. That is how you recolor Microsoft Flight Simulator to enhance the looks of your default sim. Uh, this is completely free and really easy. If you do not have the NVIDIA uh, experience or GeForce experience rather, or the control panel, make sure you have those installed and the experimental features are enabled. It's possible that by the time this video is released, it will actually just be already part of the default like sim and uh, the system that NVIDIA uses to uh, make the overlay work guys and girls thank you so much for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it please uh like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye bye